All right, how to reset your time on your control panel for your aerobic septic. Okay, uh, what happens usually due to uh, uh, power outages, your timer will get off and uh, you could be out there mowing like uh, what happened to me. I was out there mowing and my timer was five hours off because the power went out for almost five hours and I was getting completely soaked by the, uh, the sprinklers for the aerobic system. So anyway, all you have to do is uh, get a Phillips head screwdriver right here, Phillips head screwdriver, and you're gonna open up these two tabs right here, two screws and uh, take them out and then the door will be easy to open for the control panel. Once you open the control panel, you can get in and you can see the timer. Make sure to be safe in this area here because you do not want to touch anything in here except this, uh, this timer because uh, uh, th there's electricity all over the place here. But anyway, uh, so you understand, just keep safety in mind. Um, right now, it's uh, I've lost about 15 minutes of time. I noticed that they started up uh, the sprinklers a little bit after eight, so I was gonna see what's going on here. And I can see right now that my, uh, my timer is off and it's quite easy to fix all you have to do is just turn the body to the right and there we are I'm already set for 1130 now and that's wonderful that's the way it should be okay so as you can see the arrow here is pointing to the correct time okay so that's 1130 and you should see a.m. right there it's 1130 a.m. right now so when you're resetting your timer remember only turn it to the right to reset it and if you miss it just go around again and do it all over don't go left okay that's what I was told by the septic guy do not go left you can mess these up and you don't want to mess these up because it's expensive so always go right turn or clockwise clockwise around and and turn it till you get close to your time that's close enough to my time I'm good with that all right and you also got to see that if you want to check your uh, sprinkler set times this is these little tabs here and they're quite easy to use you just take your finger and push them out like that and you push them back in to take them out okay if you want your sprinklers to go off I want mine to go from 1 to 8 okay so it'd be 8 in the morning till 1 everything's backwards on this timer here so you gotta get used to that 8 o'clock is when it happens 1 is when it stops so right now my sprinklers could go off at any time during this period if, if the tank gets full okay and that's the uh, the pump tank pump tank gets full of uh, water and the sensor comes and tells it here to turn on the sprinklers during this time period and you also want this tab here at this line here you don't want to bring it all the way up because when you bring it all the way up it's just gonna it's gonna run all the time and you don't want that you want it to run at a specific time so you don't get splashed like I did when I was mowing but anyway that's real easy to set the timer turn it to the right so you get the right time if you miss it just go around the horn again okay and also to set your sprinkler times it's really easy to just push the tabs out and the, the time period you want usually it's a one two three four five period uh, hour five hour period of time to sprinkle it gives enough time to relieve the tanks so that's it uh, from me on this uh, good luck god bless works for me